Good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are, welcome to Iconic TV. My name is DJ Iconic, this is Iconic TV. Right about now, I'm about to show you the face of entitlement and also show you that Kenyans on Twitter cannot allow anyone to disrespect other people's hustle. Yeah, but before we go any further, let's dive in and watch this video together of Miss Trudy, a Kenyan content creator, married to Wademaya. Apparently, she was at the airport, at the more international airport at Mombasa in Kenya. And as usual, she was filming her travel vlogs. Yeah. And then, this is what happened. She was obstructing the entrance. And we all know that at the airport, you're not allowed to go around filming that is a protected area okay not all areas of the airport but just some yeah so here she was on i th i think domestic departures at the entrance all right let's watch it together and then we'll try to decipher or try to see uh, from different angles what really happened let's go mm -hmm. As you can see, it's just some banter with our friends. Uh, let's see what proceeded. Okay, okay, okay. Then this happened. As you can see, this uh, young gentleman, busy on his usual day-to-day -day work. This is what happens. He just comes kindly, tells her, Hey, madam, move to the side. You're obstructing the entrance. Okay, let's see. You see, what was her reaction? She's been told, Hey, madam, move to the side. This is the entrance. And there she goes. She explodes now. But I have to tell you, someone on Twitter said that she was on her periods. I don't know. I don't know whether like, that is totally right or wrong. But look, the way things ex escalated. This is the first video. I have a second one. The one that she posted. The one that she wanted us to see. Not this one. Where she was told to move aside. She showed us the chaos. Let me show you the video after this one. So when we are filming, we are being stopped, we are told not to film. Uh -huh. This is insane. And this is what we talk about, being harassed as a See? Who has harassed her? She's saying that this is what uh, content creators go through every day, being harassed. In Kenya, content creators are way much respected. No one will harass you unless you're on the wrong side. Alright? So that was the first video. Let me take you to the second one. Stay with me. We have something to digest. All right. Let me show you the video that she really wanted us to watch. Uh, apparently, it backfired, especially on Twitter. On Instagram, her followers were very sympathetic with her. But on Twitter, that is where you find rational people, not anyone after clout very opionate, opionated people let me show you this one you're gonna love it all right let's go how are you feeling wherever you are i forgot to check up on you as always remember to drink some water all right pause full screen oh here we are as you can see then uh, the people in the orange and yellow what do we call this type of clothing uh mom and i've forgotten the name but the people in in yellow and orange are the kaa kenya airport authority security officers yeah and then the one in blue is the kenya police so apparently when the kaa realized that these was things were a little bit escalating they involved the police all right let's watch the video together uh, come on 
<laughs> As you can see, her temper is way up there, and yet, look at the security officers. Everyone is just chilling and wondering, hey, madam, what's really happening? What's up with you? Huh? All right, let's continue. <laughs> So this is what we said as a content creator wherever you go ask for, for permission to film or if there is no one to ask for permission first find out whether people are allowed to film there or just look around for you know those disclaimers no photography no video yeah and stuff like that no. brought a police to arrest me because I'm I'm creating content. No, 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 Miss Trude, it's not about your content. And everyone kindly tell her that this. It is not about your content. It's not about content creators. It's about you as a person. Your name is Gertrude. And Gertrude, who was interrupting, was obstructing the entrance. Because of content. Because of content. And this is Kenya. <laughs> this is Kenya. No. 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 They actually called the police on us. Yes, because you are becoming, you are becoming a nuisance. No, 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 no. no. We are literally doing nothing. I'm just creating content. I'm leaving Mombasa. I'm going back to Nairobi. Someone stops me at the entrance. Put a rope on me. This guy stops me. Starts harassing me, telling me to stop. No, 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 nobody harassed her. And we all saw from the first video, she has been stopped. Yeah, but was she harassed? If I see you on the door and I tell you, hey, move. And if this one happens everywhere. Even when you're, outside, when you're in town, outside someone's shop, the security will tell you, hey, you're obstructing the entrance. Kindly move to the side. No one has harassed you. Creating content. I'm just tired. Look, look, look fast at how chill the security officers are chill. They're even smiling and wondering, hey, madam, what's this all about? Content creators have, content creators have a right to create content. And you can, as you can see, as she's yapping, as she's ranting, no one is paying attention, especially the officers. Yeah? And this should not be happening in 2020. We are not doing anything illegal. Yes, content creators should not be harassed, that is true. And they should not be... what else? No one has, has, has troubled content creators in Kenya, no one. I'm a Kenyan citizen, I'm not even shooting in the security. <laughs> I'm outside, I'm outside and I'm being harassed. Now imagine if it happened in other states, in other other places, yeah? Babe, could have been tough. No, this is bad. This is so in my opinion, let me read for you some of the laws that she might have breached. Yeah. If there is any action that can be taken against her, she broke three rules. Lack of permit to film is number one. You feel me? That is number one. Yeah. So depending on where you are filming, you may need to obtain a permit. The second one is causing obstruction. Aha, uh -huh. when filming in the airport, you must be mindful of other people's rights to use and enjoy the facilities there. That means you cannot block sidewalks, corridors, entry points or other areas in the airport. Yeah. And looking at the video, Miss Trudy was blocking the entrance. Yeah. Then the third one is a breach of people's privacy. When filming in the airport you must be mindful of people's privacy rights that means you cannot film without their consent if there is a reasonable expectation of privacy so uh the last about breaching people's privacy i have to say something i am a gym trainer but as a gym this is what we say when you are filming yeah that is a public place when you are filming you are the one obstructing other people yeah people are not in your space you are in their space so the best thing to film is when there is low traffic or look or just yeah yeah when there is low traffic but don't bother anyone about your filming you feel me so that's it for this video you tell me in the comments what you think whether it is the security guys who are wrong or it is miss trudy 
because I don't understand why she had to turn this thing to be all about content creators and content creators being harassed. Yeah, it's all about her as a person. And that's it for this video. <laughs> Feel good. Sip some water if you get in angry. Sip some water. Feel good. And that's it. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good time. Bye-bye. Peace.